I'm excited and a little bit skeptical if I'm being honest. My own family was like, mom, you're gonna kill Reese. We are going to a vet today to check out Violet and her health before she starts her journey with wild earth dog food. You could say that we've spent a lot of time together. She has been my constant for the past eight years. Sorry, I didn't mean to get emotional. She was there with me through some of the hardest and darkest times of my life. I was really, really thrilled when I tried Wild Earth because within the first week, she was completely different. I was so impressed. I said, we have to challenge other people to use this dog food. We challenged four pet parents and their dogs to make the switch to Wild Earth for 30 days. Neither the pet parents or their dogs have tried a plant-based diet prior to this challenge. Throughout the challenge, we asked each pet parent to document their dog's transformation journey. You want dinner? I do too, pal. I am jumping into an experiment with Wild Earth, switching my dog's current food to solely Wild Earth food, and I'm excited and a little bit skeptical if I'm being honest. Perhaps vegan dog food can be a good thing. Let me one of my dogs. He's all white. He gets horrible allergies, always has. We have tried everything. We've switched food, shampoos, and antibiotics, and shots. Also, my other dog, Wednesday, she has the same issue with the skin allergies, but her main issue is digestive problems and stomach problems. Doesn't want to eat. It's been kind of a nightmare. I'm really excited to start this. I think that this could be the solution we've been looking for. We just got to LA. We are going to a vet today to check out Violet and her health before she starts her journey with wild earth dog food. She has not been the most healthy eater. I'm really excited for her to get on, you know, a strict healthy diet and see where it goes. Violet is like my daughter. <laughs> She's very spoiled. It's almost like if you give a child like just junk food the whole time, it's hard to get them off that. And it's the same thing as a pet. I mean, we've tried every type of dog food and she just wouldn't eat it. And I know people say like, just put it out there and she cries, just wait until she eats it. But we're not like that. Reese is my four-year-old rescue pup that I absolutely love. She's such an important member of our family. You know, she relies on me to give her the proper care and nourishment and attention. And then in return, she gives me all the cuddles and love. And it's just like a beautiful bond that you can't get, like through any other relationship, but through a pet. I knew something wasn't right. She would eat and then vomit afterwards. And then like with her bowel movements, it was like a combination of diarrhea or major constipation. My husband was really skeptical about a vegan-based dog food. My own family was like, Mom, you're gonna kill Reese. But I just said, it's worth trying. Everything we had fed her up to that point had animal products. So I was really excited to see if it would make a difference. This is Athena. I knew that she was having issues. As German Shepherds, they tend to be a lot more prone for digestion issues. And I noticed that she was notorious for chewing her paws. So I did a lot of research and I tried different foods with her and they all were making her very, very sick. She was having explosive diarrhea and she just wasn't herself. Not only was she eating like bad ingredients, but she was gaining weight. Whatever I was doing, I needed to stop being so cheap with it. Good morning, you guys. So we just woke up. Wanted to just update you on how everything's going with Wild Earth and how she's feeling, how she's liking the food. Overall, like her stomach issues where it sounds almost like bombs going off in her stomach. Like I have not heard any of those weird sounds since she started eating this. Hi guys, we are at day three of her eating Wild Earth and she is doing great. I've noticed when she uses the bathroom outside, she can do it comfortably and her tummy seems to be responding really well. We are on day 15. Things are going really well. They cannot get enough of this food. Wednesday is a very picky eater, but she eats it so much faster than she's ever eaten her old food. Wednesday has not had any of her normal diarrhea or vomiting. And also Wednesday's breath seems to be a lot better. I used to not be able to, I could not handle her breath. And Pugsley, he, I've been watching him, he is a very pink dog. I'm seeing a lot less pink on him. 
He's still, you know, he's got some like natural pink edges, but as far as like rashes and flare-ups, I haven't seen anything. So I don't think that's a coincidence. I'm definitely a big believer now in investing more in her diet. I mean, I couldn't even imagine losing her. Like, and if it was something, you know, related to her diet, like I couldn't live with myself. What I was most surprised about was that her paw chewing stopped. And I really believe that a huge part of it is skin allergies, but also because her stomach was probably not upset anymore, she wasn't using her paw as an outlet to deal with her pain and anxiety. When you don't have the stress of knowing that your baby isn't feeling well, it just completely changes your relationship with them because they're excited to go for a walk and they're excited to greet you at the door. I know that she is so much happier and she's living her best life just by switching to Wild Earth. Since switching to Wild Earth dog food, just so many improvements that I'm really, really happy about. I just feel like she's healing from the inside out. We're absolutely continuing with Wild Earth. Yeah, I don't think there's any way that I could ever go back. Consistently been blown away this month. I'm so happy and delighted for our dogs who just all of their problems have <laughs> magically solved themselves. So thank you, Wild Earth. And I think if they could speak, they would be saying the same thing. You've seen the results. Now it's your turn to take the Wild Earth 30 Day Dog Food Challenge and transform your dog's health in just 30 days. Cheers. Cheers. I can't believe how not bad that is. <laughs>